Laxity by tax officials in implementing regulations on the digital economy could be aiding tax evasion, according to tax experts. And a lot of their consumers are not even businesses, so it's an individual, it's you and I. You know, I want to buy a shoe, I go on to Amazon, I buy the shoe, it comes, you know, I've paid using my Visa card or a transfer from my bank. At what point in time, you know, does your end then capture that? That's the struggle that we've had. Also of concern to accountants is the non-absorption of the staggering 439 billion shillings by agencies of government. Money returned to the Treasury in the financial year 2018-2019. Well, we're also aware that uh, Parliament has already passed the budget for the financial year that we are already in, we are in July. And many times I've been pondering what, what, what happens to that money because uh, I've never seen Parliament reconvened to say that now so much trillions have been returned and uh, this is an addition to the new budget. So the Seventh Institute of Certified Public Accountants Economic Forum is being anchored on the theme Transformation for Social Economic Empowerment. That's why we chose that theme this time round to see if we're actually growing. Are we growing structurally? Are we, gr uh, are we growing economically? And how do all those things translate into the quality of life of the Ugandans that we have?